With the holidays right around the corner, cruises are officially crushing once again, buoyed by consumer confidence after a rough ride with COVID. From first-time sailors like Tuffy Kriegel, who's about to jump on a Caribbean cruise in December. Seven, eight days with my friends and experiencing life on a cruise ship. To families like the Stewarts in New York. The ships have never been cleaner. The elevators, everything they do is clean. Who hit the high seas for decades before COVID cut into their tradition. But now it's full steam ahead. So no concern at this point about taking your family on a cruise? None whatsoever. There have been fewer outbreaks and the CDC removed its COVID restrictions in July. But over the weekend, a Carnival Australia cruise ship returned to Sydney with more than 800 people infected with the virus who were promptly isolated. Still, in a major shift, a recent survey found about two in three passengers say they're no longer concerned about catching COVID on cruises. And demand for sailings has spiked. Are people going to pay higher than they ever have for a cruise? Yes. Are the selections of accommodations going to be limited? Yes. Are the ships going to be full? Yes. But are people going to have a great time? Absolutely. For travelers scouring for savings, travel experts say book the relatively cheaper interior rooms and spend more time outside those rooms enjoying the amenities. Ports across the country offer access to tropical locations so you don't necessarily have to fly to reach your ship. And you're more likely to find the best deals at busier ports like Miami or Fort Lauderdale and use travel agencies for special packages on drinks and services. We might offer a private car and driver at a particular destination when it's a European cruise or something like a shipboard credit that could be $100, $200. With demand high for the holidays, here's where you'll find the most cruises between Christmas and New Year's. Miami and Fort Lauderdale top the list, but New Orleans, Texas, and even New York have offerings. Do you still see this as a better value proposition than going to a hotel and resort where food isn't included and all of that? A hundred percent. You have your food that's top notch. You have, you know, alcohol packages. For a family of four to go away and get all this together is really economical. Some of those cruise ships look next level. Sam, just really quickly here, why is it, going back to that list, why is it that Miami and Fort Lauderdale have the best deals? So they have the mega ships, Greg. When you're talking about the cruise lines that have ships with capacity for four to 5,000 passengers, it's basically where I'm standing because Miami and South Florida is the jumping off point to get to the Caribbean. Obviously, there's a lot of demand there. There's plenty of smaller vessels as well. So if you think about it almost like hubs for airlines where there's the highest volume of flights, you're more likely as a passenger to find a better deal. The same thing is true with cruise ships. The more space they have, the more open rooms. You'll find that in South Florida. But as we showed you a second ago, you can really go to many places across the country and find an option heading into the holidays. And join me anytime you want here down in Miami, guys. I can tell you it's looking pretty good it always does Sam Rock. it always does thank you buddy uh speaking of the holiday rush folks and, and what all travelers can expect lester holt's going to have an exclusive conversation with secretary of transportation pete Buttigieg. that's coming up tonight on nbc nightly news be careful what you wish for sam brock we might just have to get down there and <laughs> go cruising <laughs> with him i think today's that might not I, I think a today show cruise we're, get, we're gonna will warrant it, it. into we being show island there you oh, go oh, i'm here oh, for it I like yes. it i know let's just keep it going Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.